Skylar fans, welcome back to Skylar Nation. Mom and woman versus food. Always cleaning my plate because wasted food is rude. Got another fire challenge today. <laughs> League of Fire, you never cease to amaze me. So Old Agnes store, I ordered a bunch of stuff once again from them. And I do have the Rummy Bears Endurance Challenge. Things like this actually aren't as easy as you think, just because of the fact that they are so extremely hot and I have time frames and constraints that I have to go within for the boundaries of this. I can only take one spoonful of this every 30 seconds until I'm done with the bottle and complete the challenge, or I have to quit because I can't take it anymore because this is just gonna rot my stomach. Ugh. Awful. Love it. League of Fire, Sons of Fire. Let's do this. Get this out of the way. I, Molly Schuyler, am over the age of 18 and or older of sound mind and have read and understood the hot sauce product disclaimer on the League of Fire website. In summary, I accept that the League of Fire, their suppliers and manufacturers will under no circumstances be responsible for or liable for any claims or injury or damage arising from me consuming this product or multiple thereof. I acknowledge and agree to the fact to this fact without question. Yes. Like I said, every 30 seconds I can take a spoonful. Let's see if I can finish this thing and complete the challenge. This is spicy. Eh. Gross. Yum. Ouch. Help. All right, cool. Got my timer here. I'll be watching this. I'll be touching every 30 seconds. I'm gonna refill it prior to the time. So I can just, just keep going, keep going, keep going. Hopefully I can finish this if I can't. I'm a loser. Anyway, it has been sealed. It has not been opened. You can hear it. There you go. Ugh, smells like yeah. All right, I can start my clock, I guess, after the first spoonful has been consumed. Love you guys. Let's do this. It has been shaken up. It is probably this nasty, deathly orange. It's, well, I don't know, it's supposed to, uh, I'm spilling it. Uh, help, 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 help. All right, so I guess I'm not gonna fill it quite as full because I do not want to waste the product or make, I am making an absolute mess right now, I'm so sorry. But it's, it is still full. Um, let's do this. Three, two, one. Mm. Like I said, it's not a very deep spoon, so. Well, like I said, I did spill it. You can see a couple drops right here. Not a whole heck of a lot to make a difference, but enough to make a difference. So I'm going to keep it over here <coughs> and not try to obviously spill this stuff because then I fail and I suck. So. It has some good flavor to it, though. Starting to burn my tummy. It has almost a delicious little flavor to it. I just. Mmm. Uh. It's delicious. <laughs> oh, I love this kind of stuff. It's. <laughs> It just makes it fun. It's like at least like I can just keep going every couple seconds, just keep talking. Like I said, try not to spill. It, de it definitely has some fire in the back of my throat. My lips are burning a little bit. Not awful yet. But like I said, I'll even lick the napkin afterwards just to make you people happy. <laughs> All right. I almost feel like it tastes like a pineapple or something in here. Not quite sure what it is. Initially, the kick when you taste it, when you throw it in your mouth, it actually is kind of like, hmm, 
That's where the kick is, but the burn isn't that bad. I think I'm getting more of it on my lips in the back of my throat. It's actually pretty tasty. Like I said, I will lick the napkin for you guys. I've got a little bit on there, but not really anything substantial. Ooh. I did the Rummery Bear Psycho Challenge on the original run. Uh, the Psycho Bears. That was actually neat. They're very chewy gummy bears. So that's not a bad challenge at all. So if you guys ever want to get the hookup on that, I know Old Agnes sells that. A couple of those flyers, Shriek of Fire. getting down there. It's more of the initial kick right when you get into your mouth. I also have to have a two minute afterburn on this. Ooh, somebody is... Sorry, kids have school. Initial kick is not is probably the worst part. Yeah, you can come in. Yeah, okay. it's a spicy one. I'm just trying to get a one just for the heck. <laughs> I ordered like 15 things from the old Agnes store. What's up, YouTube? What's up, yo? <laughs> All the deliciousness that comes in the bottle. Mmm. Note how the said rule of awesomeness hasn't changed since the last time. <laughs> Nothing happened in this room. I'm getting more of a burn on my lips than anything, really. It's not that awful, but it actually has a decent taste to it. I cannot complain. No. Every 30 seconds. Mm -mm. Right. There really isn't anything in here, but I mean, literally, it's kind of, yeah. It's empty. I'll go for an extra couple seconds anyway, just because, like I said, we do need a two minute afterburn. As you can see, my lips are actually on fire. <laughs> They're getting red. Yeah, it's all right. All right. Not bad. It does almost have, I want to, I want to say a citrusy or something. I said I did get a little on there, but nothing intentional. Probably should wash and bleach that desk afterwards. So I'll go to the 30 minute or 30 second mark there and I'll hit my two minutes. Alright, so I need two minutes now. So once I'm at eight minutes, I'm done. So anyway, honestly, this could have been a heck of a lot worse. Um it actually has seriously good flavor. I want I, I was picking up on some fruit in there. Um I want to say pineapple I don't know it's not awful it is actually very tasty I can do I could probably do several bottles of this like several several bottles because I'm really not getting any after effect in my mouth I've got a little bit of burn on my lips um back in my throat yeah I think the initial kick was when I first started it because I'm not really huge on vinegary anything um so I usually kind of get a kick off stuff like that but really the pain in my mouth is nothing uh throat nothing lips Probably that's the most burn I've got right now. Not painful at all. I could probably do quite a bit of this. I would, I would chug. I would chug that. Um, yeah. So, either which way, amazing challenge. Like I said, Rummy Bears. It's a Henry's Hot Sauce Endurance Challenge. Check that out. You can buy that online. I got mine from Old Agnes Store. 
Um, they're out of Oregon. Super nice people. Love it. Very delicious though. I uh, quite enjoy some of these. Some of them have actually been very tasty. The Death Nut. I've got the Death Nut 3.0 challenge coming up sometime soon. Um, I don't know which order I'm going to put my, vid my videos in, but if you see that one, that one's probably the one I'm going to be afraid of the most. I, uh, so the, I did the 2.0 or the, or the ter tube of terror. That was awful. Gross. Um, other than that, like I said, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. If there are any kind of challenges that you would like to sponsor, let me know. I would gladly take it on. Just message below. There's a thing in the description where you can find where to message me at or whatever the heck you want to do. Always glad to have a little bit of interaction with that. I appreciate it. Like I said, it's you guys who make the videos happen. And I enjoy doing it. So, thanks guys. I got my over two minutes in there. Like I said, not bad. Actually, not a horrible challenge, but I guess it's supposed to be awful, but you can see it a little bit red. Other than that, I don't know what to tell you. Maybe I should do a couple more. <laughs> Thanks for watching once again, guys. I will catch you later. Molly Skyler, Mom and Woman versus Food. See you next time.